Have you ever wondered what goes on behind those brilliant white sails of the Sydney Opera House? As one of the most recognized buildings in the world, the Sydney Opera House intrigues people across the globe. Nestled majestically along the shores of Sydney Harbour, its sculpted shells seem to float gracefully above the water. But there's more to this architectural wonder than its stunning facade. In this exclusive behind-the-scenes tour, you'll get insider access to the inner workings of the Sydney Opera House. We'll uncover the storied history of how this iconic landmark was built. You'll get to peek backstage at the mechanics that bring its world-class stages to life with their state-of-the-art equipment, so be sure to stick around till the end. From the soaring vaulted ceilings of the concert halls to the intimate rehearsal spaces, you'll experience the Opera House as few get to see it. Join me on an unforgettable adventure to discover the hidden gems and untold secrets of Australia's majestic performing arts centre. The Sydney Opera House we know today was built after plenty of drama and delays behind the scenes. In 1957, young Danish architect Jorn Utzon won an international design competition to create an arts centre on Sydney Harbour. His visionary design featured soaring white shells reminiscent of ship sails billowing in the wind. Construction began in 1959, but budget overruns and technical challenges quickly mounted. The unique curved shells puzzled engineers and caused major timeline setbacks. Costs skyrocketed, leading to clashes with the government. After seven years of political disputes, Utzon sadly resigned in 1966 without ever seeing his architectural masterpiece completed. It wasn't until 1973 that the Opera House finally opened to the public, a decade later than planned. But when those brilliant white sails were unveiled, the years of construction chaos were forgotten. Over one million dazzling ceramic tiles covered the sweeping shells crafted specifically to self-clean and glisten in the harbor. Since its opening, the UNESCO World Heritage Site has undergone renovations in 1999 and 2007 to improve acoustics and accessibility, all while preserving its historic character. Today, over 8 million visitors a year flock to see about 1,500 incredible performances within its halls. Against all odds, Utsan's vision was finally realized, becoming one of the world's most iconic landmarks. Did you know over a hundred different designs were considered before Utsan's sail-like shells were selected? Constructing his vision took over a decade and ballooned way over budget to $102 million. The ceramic roof tiles were especially engineered to be self-cleaning and reflect light differently day versus night. Those iconic sails are made up of 580 concrete panels precast off-site. No two are exactly alike. Inside, 891 heaters allow shows to go on despite Sydney's cooler weather. An astonishing 645 kilometers of electrical cables power the complex. The Concert Hall Grand Organ has 10,154 pipes, making it the largest mechanical organ on Earth. And get this, in 2020, the Opera House switched fully to renewable energy from the Badangara Wind Farm. From solar power to perfect acoustics, this marvel of architecture continues to innovate and impress over 40 years after its completion. Now that we've sailed through the rocky history of how this Sydney icon came to be, Let's set our course for the concert halls hidden beneath its world-famous sails. Within its iconic shells, the Sydney Opera House contains multiple venues to host an incredible array of performances. The largest and most amazing is the Concert Hall, seating over 2,600 people in a grand yet wonderfully intimate setting. As you walk inside, you're wowed by the vaulted ceilings and continental seating flowing out from the massive central stage. Engineers specially crafted the geometry for acoustic excellence. Curving wooden beams reflect and scatter sound, making every seat in the house an acoustic gem. Here, you can imagine hearing the soaring vocals of Pavarotti or the smooth melodies of Ella Fitzgerald echoing through the hall. Just next door, the Joan Sutherland Theatre provides a more traditional proscenium stage setting under a dazzling glass ceiling. 
and for an intimate experience, the Utzon Room delivers acoustic perfection and elegant Scandinavian design in a small performance space. Between the opera theater, drama theater, and more, the opera house caters to music, theater, dance, and more. Across six unique venues within one iconic setting, over 2,500 productions come to life each year. As you tour the halls, you can vividly imagine the world's best performers on these storied stages and the audiences who've shared in memorable cultural experiences. Now that you've seen the concert halls under the sails, it's time to go behind the scenes to uncover how the magic happens on these iconic stages. Now it's time for an exclusive look behind the curtain to see how the Sydney Opera House brings performances to life. First, we'll go backstage to find an endless maze of scaffolding, catwalks, and equipment to run these massive productions. See the hydraulic lifts and rigging to hoist enormous, elaborate sets into place with pinpoint precision. With state-of-the-art lighting and sound, technicians use extensive grids of technology to sculpt perfect scenes. In the costume shop, fabulous outfits worn by performers are handcrafted. Rack upon rack showcases dazzling sequin gowns and intricate period pieces. Next door, we'll peek into the props room, overflowing with swords, furniture, and odd knickknacks for any scene. Meet the carpenters, electricians, stagehands, and more who operate this well-oiled machine. See the orchestra pit lift that can raise musicians up and down without a sound. Outside at the loading docks, massive trucks deliver sets, gear, and even helicopters to the opera house. Throughout this behind-the-scenes tour, the crews share their passion for bringing performances to life. It takes hundreds of people working in sync to make the magic happen on stage and in the audience. Their stories give a new appreciation for the tremendous efforts underlying any great opera house show. Now, after seeing how the Sydney Opera House runs behind the scenes, let's explore the best ways for visitors to experience this icon, from front row seats to backstage tours. To fully experience this Sydney icon, take one of the informative daily guided tours. Expert guides will share architectural details and history as you walk underneath the soaring shells and peek into the theaters. For a breathtaking view, head to the highest outdoor viewing platform looking over Sydney Harbour. Don't miss snapping pictures from the Opera House steps, the Botanic Gardens, and Circular Quay. The lighting is magical at sunset when the white sails glow orange and pink. If you see a performance, Book tickets early online to get the best seats and prices. The most in-demand orchestra seats sell out fast. Guided backstage tours should also be booked in advance for access to production workshops and more. On site, grab a steak pie or glass of Australian wine at Opera Bar, nestled on the lower concert hall terrace. For souvenirs, browse the gift shops filled with Australian arts, crafts, and memorabilia. Nearby, stroll through the Royal Botanic Gardens and check out the historic Rocks neighborhood. For a thrill, climb the arch of the Sydney Harbour Bridge. And be sure to take a ferry from Circular Quay to appreciate the Opera House's impressive waterfront location. With this insider advice, you'll be set to make the most of your visit to the magical Sydney Opera House. There you have it! A sneak peek behind the sails of the sensational Sydney Opera House. From the swept shells to the inner workings, we uncovered the singular experience of this Australian icon. With an insider's view of the venues, productions, and history, you're now equipped to plan an unforgettable visit. As one of the world's most famous performing arts centers for over 40 years and counting, the Sydney Opera House promises magical moments for artists and audiences from across the globe. Thanks for joining this backstage tour to discover the spirit within the sails that makes this landmark truly one of a kind. If you enjoyed this behind-the-scenes look at the Sydney Opera House, be sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel. Tap the notification bell so you never miss our next adventure uncovering the hidden wonders of Australia's incredible landmarks and destinations. Leave a comment sharing your favorite part of the Opera House or what you'd most love to see on your own visit. 
I'll see you in the next video. Until then, stay curious and keep exploring.